Hi, this is a quick tip on how to use key modifiers with the solo function. So um, as you can see, I have two tracks here. Let's just play. If I want to solo the drums, um, I'll just click the S here. That solos my drums. If I click now the S on synth, so that's additive. So now I'm soloing the drums and the synth. If I want to exclusively solo one track at a time, hold control and click on the track. So now I click on drums. If I click on synths, one solo, one track at a time. And if I'm not holding control, these are additive. So the control modifier with the solo function is very, very important. Um, there's also the control alt modifier. If you click on solo, it becomes a D, which means solo defeat mode which means that if you solo a track and you have tracks that are, are solo defeat, they won't get muted. So right now I'm soloing my synth, but my drum is, is not muted because it's in solo defeat. If I take out solo defeat, now the drums is muted because I'm soloing uh, my synth. So the solo defeat is very useful for, um, you can put your effects in solo defeat, you can put um, dialogue tracks in solo defeat if you're scoring or etc. That's a quick tip. Thanks.